guys, I'm Tori Sterling. Welcome back to my channel. So in every single video that I upload, my comments are always asking, where are your makeup tutorials? Why don't you do makeup tutorials anymore? I really miss your tutorials. Can you please do them? And today I'm going to finally address the reason of why I no longer do makeup tutorials. So it's really two reasons. Um, reason number one is that I don't really wear like glam makeup all the time. I actually never really do it. And whenever I do, it's super like special for an occasion. And I'm like getting other people ready too so I never have time myself to film it so that's that I only ever wear natural makeup and if I were to do all my natural makeup looks you guys would actually hate me and second reason is the reason that I'm going to demonstrate today and it's the fact that I now suck at doing my makeup because I haven't done it in like literally two years and I suck at it but instead of me just telling you that I kind of want to show you guys so I asked you guys to send me photos on Twitter and you did because you guys are still a homie and clearly still want me to do makeup tutorials so this is a look that I'm going to do or attempt to do okay it's like intense and she's bold and it really just proves that I don't know how to do makeup anymore now does this mean I'll never do them again um I don't know probably not like I don't know what my future holds but all that I'm saying is that I'm just not as good as I used to be at makeup because I don't do it as much anymore like it used to be all I did but that's not the case anymore. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in the shade Warm Beige all over my face. I literally don't even like wear foundation anymore. The only thing that I ever really wear like all over my face is either a liquid bronzer or I'll use like a Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream or the Urban Decay One and Done or I'll mix them together. Now I'm gonna do concealer. I don't think like you can really be bad at a base, so I just do my base like all the time. This is Maybelline. Dream Fresh, no, what is this? Fit Me Concealer in the shade 20. Beauty Blender, probably haven't washed it. Well, I actually haven't even used a Beauty Blender in like months because I'm so lazy, I just use my fingers. And if you ask me if I'm even sad that I'm like not that good at makeup anymore, my answer is no, I'm not even sad because like I don't really do extravagant looks anymore. So it's not even like I was like queen at those anyway. Like I just sort of like did them, but I wasn't ever like amazing at them. I'm going to take the Too Faced a Born This Way setting powder. It's like yellow toned, so I just think it looks good with a tan that I have. My tan, by the way, is all fake. I can do an entire video about all of my tanning products because that is what keeps me pretty without wearing makeup is all of my tanning products. And I use like a bunch so um, I have like a different tan product for a different purpose. So if you guys want that, let me know. I'm going to use this like to set my whole face pretty much with the Beauty Blender because I don't really care to set everything else, honestly. But I think I used to hate the Born This Way foundation, but I actually really, really like it. So bronzer is always like the same regardless of the makeup look. I'm just going to use the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Matte Bronzer. Oh God. This is like why. This is why. I don't even care if this comes out as a hot mess because that just proves my point even more. I feel like for this eye, I should definitely do like my dip brows instead of like just brow pencil. And I feel like I should like carve the brows and like all that stuff that I literally haven't done in like a year and a half. All right, I'm going to use the Anastasia Dip Brow in the shade Taupe. Did I even set my eyelids? I think so. Did I say what product I'm using? It's honestly a dip brow. Why is it focusing on the mirror? Stupid. I feel like Ryland. Do you love Shane? I love Shane. You know who I love out of all of them the most? Andrew. I honestly got to have a crush on Andrew. So if anyone wants to um, set that up, let me know. Another reason why I don't do makeup tutorials is honestly, I just don't have the passion that I used to have for makeup. I used to just love sitting down and doing my makeup and I could just spend hours here. It was very therapeutic for me. I really enjoyed it. Um, my lighting's also jank right now. Maybe I should go close that. Um, but like I was saying, I used to love just like sitting down and doing my makeup for hours and it was just like a really great escape for me. Um, especially when I was in Alabama, that really got me through um, my semester there because I was so unhappy that I would just sit in my dorm room and do my, my makeup. And I don't know, like my priorities have just really shifted in the past couple of years. So, I mean, I still love makeup. I still appreciate the beauty of it. I still really respect um, any makeup artist's work and how hard it is to do makeup and how much of an art it actually is. I personally just don't have the same passion that I used to. All right, so anyway, now that I'm done with my little sappy rant, so this makeup look. 
this is the look by the way okay so let's just like do some check-ins and like see how I do so I'm gonna start with the crease first and then I'm just gonna go in and cut the lid I think that's gonna be easier so I'm gonna take the Too Faced just peachy mattes thing oh you can't even see god this one mixed with this one and a little bit of this one but look I have something to show you guys do I need new brushes? This is a MAC brush. Let me know. All right, so in the crease we go. Oh, maybe I should, like, set down tape. I don't really care. I already don't like it. I just like neutral. I'm so boring. I like neutrals. Okay, then I'm going to take this shade called Just Ripe, okay? And I'm just going to put that in my lower crease. I don't care that I get it on my lid because I'm just going to go in and, like, cut that, so who really cares? And then I'm going to go in with my 224 and then just blend it like up. I have anxiety, I'm an awful blender. I've always been a bad blender. Like this is just dirty looking. Actually, I don't know, it looks kind of good. Okay, we're gonna move on. We're gonna go in and cut. I'm gonna take the lightest shade of Tarte Shape Tape that I have. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh God, it's a mess. This is my favorite eye, so I might like this one more. Okay, well, you know what? They're not at all even, but I just wanna move on. I hate cutting the crease. I get way too stressed out. Let's just move on. All right, I'm gonna take the shade Chocolate Dipped and put that on the outer corners. I'm not having fun. I'm just very stressed out. God, this is becoming not a cut crease. Okay, then I'm gonna go in with Peach Sangria, which to me, it looks very great. That I would not call that peach. And I'm just putting that like right next to it to kind of fade into the dark. So I got my supplies. Where did my supplies go? I honestly, like I can't talk. Like I'm in like, I'm in the mood right now. Like I'm in the zone, you know? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna take like a purple pigment. Oh yeah, I forgot how much I hate these pigments. But that's okay. Or like these glitters, whatever they're freaking called. I think my contacts have glitter like all in them. Homegirl's got a thick black wing liner, okay? And she did bring it like all the way in, which I hate doing, but it just doesn't look good with my eye. Like it just really closes my eye off. Okay. Then Homegirl put glitter liner on the bottom, which I don't want to do, but you know, I got to do what this picture is. Can you see what I'm doing? I don't know. Like I feel ridiculous, okay? I really do. Like a year ago, I would have been living for it, but now just because I'm so used to natural makeup only on me, I just feel like ridiculous. I'm not putting on fake eyelashes because I genuinely hate them. I used to wear them every single day. Lord knows how I used to do that. I have no idea how I used to do that. Um, now I just use Babe Lash, which is an eyelash serum. It just helps your eyelashes grow. I'll have a link to it down below. I swear by it. It's like what I like use to like stay feeling pretty all the time like literally i'm obsessed with it so i'm just gonna use mascara because my eyelashes are pretty long naturally now because of the serum and i have a discount code if you guys use lash like tori i think you get 20 percent off your first purchase so that's cool <laughs> i feel so dumb okay eyes are done i just want this makeup off my face highlight let's just do and like legit, let's just like finish this real quick. So this is Champagne Pop. All right, from a distance, it's bad. It's still bad. All right, lips, I don't know. I don't know, what should I do? I'm thinking like a stone. It's gonna do Stripped by Anastasia Beverly Hills because it doesn't show in the picture, so. It's open for interpretation. I'm done, like I don't wanna do it anymore. All right, I need to wash my hands. I feel gross. Okay, this is the finished look. Okay, these are the eyes. This is what they're supposed to look like, and this is what mine look like. So, did I fail? 100%, absolutely. So I guess what to take away from this video is two things. If you don't practice it, you're gonna lose it. And number two, I suck at doing makeup. It's just my reality now. Like, I'm good at doing everyday makeup, and like basic makeup and stuff that I can just throw on and not have to worry about, but extravagant makeup like this, I don't like on me, I don't think I'm good at, I don't feel good in it, I don't feel pretty in it, I feel crazy and that's that. The artist did a beautiful job, beautiful, beautiful job, but I just did an awful job recreating it. 
But yeah, this is the reality of me and makeup these days. So I hope this clears up why I no longer do makeup tutorials because literally I don't want any of you walking around with advice to look like this because this is not a cute look right now that I'm doing. Yeah, I hope you all understand. Um, I feel ridiculous. I'm gonna go wash my face. Literally, no, this is not meant to be like mean towards anyone that loves makeup and doing extravagant makeup. My camera died, so I'm just gonna finish this on here. Clearly this looks, whatever, I'm pro glam. Okay, don't, that's not what I'm trying to say. I love glam, I love supporting makeup artists, and I think if you guys can rock it, more power to you, because I can't. So, love you guys, I hope you all enjoyed this video, I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you guys in my next fitness vlog, and um, I don't know what else, but I'll see you guys soon, bye.